All right, so we got to go now and fight Saturn. Is that right? Mission is proceeding with no issues. The boss should be pleased. All right, pro bro pass. Uh, well, not yet. Kingpin first. Go for Sucker Punch. It's probably going to fail because it's probably going to go for Calm Mind. But once it sees the kill, it will do just that. And then our ultimate planana will happen. <laughs> now you're dead. Goodbye. You're dead. You're dead. You're dead. And out of this squirrel. All right. 53. Definitely going stony edge here. So you go to the cash master. The cash man can. Way to take it. Quake. That's fine. Surely it still only sees the kill with Seed Bomb on Octillery, right? Octillery Clinton, back at it. Pokemon Go to the polls. I'm just trying to get everyone to Pokemon Go to the polls. You really didn't appreciate what we had, folks. Octillery Clinton, a woman. Now homie's gonna go gunk shot with Toxic Croak. So here's the plan. Octillery Clinton, a woman. That's what I'm saying, you know? All right, so we start with a switch to Polaris on hopefully a gunk shot. Uh, I would feel sheepish if it was not a gunk shot. Now, one gunk shot. Welcome to the team, Polaris. Let those wings fly, my boy. The only thing that this doesn't work against is crit cross chop into crit bullet punch or sucker punch. Actually, I think just crit sucker punch is enough here. So, fingies crossed, folks. And we guarantee our speed with the f level 56. Psychic from Angel. That's how you use a Mothum, baby. With a three level advantage. Boom! Shakalaka! Oh, you know what I should have done? I should have taught this U turn for some Chippy Roo. Oh, although actually that would have been stupid because it could have missed. And then we would have been risking a crit. Kill. So glad I didn't do that. All right, Aggie, in you go. Probably should have taught this um, Will-O-Wisp, though I guess it doesn't ultimately really matter. You know, Clefable Table, you're doing an awful lot of song puns for the person that was like, stop. Yep, Bright Prouder does proc. Can I get another 10%? I'm sorry, I don't understand what you're saying. A bronzong. Do you like apples? Got a perfectly accurate move. How do you like them apples? I'm gonna watch that movie again. There's nothing you can do to stop me. That's that's the lady with the hair. Great. Now we ride to Salt Gem Town or whatever. All right. Deathless dream, baby. Let's do it. Commander Mars. She leads with a Crobat with Bright Powder. That's why we have Shockwave. But first, we will set up Stealth Rock to better deal with the little, uh, the little, the little, little sh- Go ahead. Double team all you want, Chief. In fact, I encourage you to keep double teaming. Don't do that. All right. Ugh. <laughs> All right. Pro Polaris, not you're not doing too hot quite yet. I would like you to do slightly hotter.
I think this is like a four hit kill, unfortunately, so we may be here a while. Oh my god, that doesn't even look like a four hit kill. Yeah, Giga Drain doesn't do squat. Now it might be a five hit. It's definitely gonna be a five hit kill with the Giga Drain recovery. Uh, we're still, we're still over 50. Okay, okay, okay. Um, does Mars heal? I guess we'll find out together, huh? Ha! <laughs> okay. Crisis averted. Sort of. All right. Give me that good, good 50% yan yummy. Now, yeah, Mega, why would you do that? Is it because you see it as a fighting type move? And you're a bit dense? Is that what's happening here? Can Bug Buzz flinch or does it just drop Spadef? I think it just drops Spadef, right? Uh, I'm gonna protect for a turn. Because why not? Ah, it just wants to go hammer arm. Okay, we go to Taskmaster. The one and only, the Tasky Mask. Nice job, Taskmaster. I'm so freaking proud of you, bro. You don't even know. You don't even know. I can make your hands clap. All right, so now this is going double edge, presumably. So we can go Polaris again. Every night when the sun goes down, am I the only living soul around? Um, all right, that was quad resisted, decent damage, not gonna lie. All right, here's what's gonna happen, Kangaskhan. You're gonna miss this, because that would be funny. Not what I said, Chief. That is not what I said. Um, actually, shoot, I don't think we guarantee the kill on this after this. Oopsies. Ah, all right, we got to go back. Nah, Probo Pass wasn't a needed encounter, but it definitely helps a hell of a lot. It may be a needed encounter uh, against the double battle, the multi. I don't know. We'll see. All right. That's more than enough damage. I can make your hands clap. I can make your hands clap. Every night when the sun goes down, am I the only... I probably should have protected. Long time, amigo, long time. Uh, this is probably just going fake out, so we'll go Iron Man. Might just in hypnosis, I guess. Ha! Ah, can't get paralyzed this way, baby. Not, I did not appreciate that, Iron Man. Dude, can we, can we, can we, can we, come on! Come on, come on! Come on! Alright, Hypno Miss. Yeah, baby. Wow. Wow. <laughs> Time is a circle. Time is a circle. Wow, double body slam, no para. This might be the least lucky Mars I've ever seen. Squeak! All right. That's the... That's the galactic grunts and admins beaten. 
Yes. yes. Cool. Did we beat Mars last time? You freaking know it. Of course we did. We're going to get to Snowpoint City. We're going to try and beat that multi-battle. Uh, it's not a multi-battle. The double battle. And then if we have time to beat um, Candace, that's what we'll do. All right, Dalton. You prick. Starts with Mag Mortar, but we have the best water type in the freaking game, baby. We got Mofo Luminion with Choice Spec Surf, baby. All right, word. I'd love if you didn't try to sleep powder me. Yeah, you just pedal dance. Okay, bozo. Right. So now we simply kill him with two aerial aces because he's stuck in pedal dance. That's how pedal dance works, I, I believe. All right, quick question. Hail does how much? That was a crit. Oh my God. My sweet baby boy. I could protect once though for a bit of chip, but I think we just U-turn here. This is what you're gonna do, Venus. So, oh, he crits anyways. Taskmaster, my boy. Is my boy! Is my boy! Gee whiz. Gee whiz, gee whiz. Ninjask said, if you crit me, I crit you. Um, so next up we have this double battle against these people. There's like a an annoying double battle against a bunch of Johto Pokemon. That's the gimmick. Alright. These homies are a little bit scary. It's a random ass double battle. Aran and Nafine. So guys, remember, we have a prediction going for how many times Heracross is going to protect. Is he going to go for two protects? Is he going to go for one protect? I'm hoping he goes for none protects because he sees the kill on sweet little uh, Mothim here, Mothim. And we're simply going to Air Slash Heracross and Fake Out Glissy. Hell yeah. Zero protects. Who won? Who won the chat? Prediction. Sound off. Sound off. All right, Mathim Abdul-Jabbar is actually destroying this. Unfortunately, I would like to stay in and simply kill this Tyranitar. Wait, 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 can we? Wait a minute, can we? Wait a minute, get your head in the game. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Can we? Can we not just budge buzz? Wait, 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 wait. So in the sand, it didn't set up light screen. So budge buzz does 44 to 54%. It should see the kill again, so it should want to go rock slide. Yeah, so we guarantee the kill with bug buzz. Bug buzz, Tyranitar. Wake up slap, Tyranitar. Yeah, and it didn't protect. Let's go. Let's freaking go. All right, now it's just the freaking Typhlosion. Now I'm curious. Yeah, soft boiled? Oh, oh, Blissey. You poor, poor, sad, tragic bastard. Tyranitar, it might not want to go for Lava Plume if it's going to do damage to Blissey. It might just want to hit to Chubby. We're at 117. Yeah, we're going to protect Angel. And we're going to... Oh, man, I don't have Body Slam. I have Aerial Ace, right. I don't have Protect on to Chubby either. Okay, okay, to Chubby. Go big or go home. You're going to slap this Typhlosion. All right, Angel goes for Protect. T'Challa uses Wake Up Slap for a little bit of damage. Yeah, Typhlosion does go Lava Plume. Shouldn't be much. Oh, it's a crit! No! No! Blissey, use Light Screen. Blissey, use Light Screen. Also, LOL. Okay, okay. It just it just goes, ooh. But that's not good because now it could go random move onto Chubby. 
All right, little scary, little scary. Hilarious that he burned his own Blissey. I think we definitely W turn into Aggie. W-E. Got the Shuka. Okay, so actually we go in, we, we bring Aggie on T'Challa and we bring Nebby. No, 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 we go Juggernaut here. Oh! Okay. I'm the world's greatest Nuzlocker, guys. All right, Typhlosion is 117. Do we outspeed with Houndoom? I don't think we do. I don't think we outspeed with either. All right, I think Aggie is good to protect. Juggernaut is good to... I think I think this is safe. Yeah, I think we're good to Waterfall, Typhlosion. So Earth Power, even like Crit Earth Power into Blissey, Crit, Dazzling Gleam or something. Shouldn't kill here. I'd rather keep Aggie healthy. I guess, well, actually, does Aggie, does Aggie kill from this range? Because if Aggie kills from this range, it might just be better to double up. I'm going to Waterfall Typhlosion and Protect with Ag. And no Protect from Typhlosion. Earth Power into Agatha. Soft Boil on Blissey. You do you, Chief. And now Juggernaut takes the Typhlosion. He's the Juggernaut! <coughs> oh, jeez. <coughs> Flinch! <coughs> Woo! That was close with a crit. That looked real close. Good job, Juggernaut. I'm the Juggernaut! All right, see you guys in five minutes. All right, this should go Meg. Sludge Bomb does 95, 114%. So we got to protect here. Definitely going to go Pedal Dance into Juggernaut, I'd assume. I guess it could also go Earth Power into both, but we're going to protect and protect. Ah, yeah, I went Earth Power into Aggie. All right, let's uh, switch Juggernaut into Moon Dragon. Yeah, 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 okay, we got it, we got it. Moon Dragon and Aggie goes Sludge Bomb on McGee. <coughs> That's a bulky gal. Needed the chip to get this kill, I'll guarantee it. But there we go. Okay. Gator does nothing to Altaria. Yeah, okay, so we don't, nobody takes chip with Altaria's Cloud9. I forgot about that. All right, in hindsight, should have taught this, should have kept Moonblast on this homie. We're gonna Dragon Claw you, and we're gonna go to Polly. Bum, 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 bum. That was cheeks of damage. Uh, I assume close combat kills. I guess I probably shouldn't assume. With the chip, it'll kill. Defense drop? Nope. Should kill with two dragon claws, I'd assume. Yeah, that's 75%. Kills with a crit. <laughs> um, unfortunately, we also don't get anything from Snowpoint Temple. We already have a Galalee and everything else is banned. So, all right. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. I feel, I feel, I feel like I'm getting punked here. What the, what the damn hell? So you got to get over there, which means you got to hit that homie, which means you got to hit that. Oh. I figured it out. 
I figured it out. I figured it out. I figured it out. I figured it out. All right. All right. All right. Ready? 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 Right here. Here we go. I got it. I got it. Boom. Down. Boom. 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 Okay. Boom. 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 Ain't nothing gonna break my style. All right, we might as well try and fight Candace. Mm, I'm being honest. So leader Candice has Obama Snow, Weavile, Glaceon, Walrein, Mamoswine, and Frostlash. Okay, so we could stall you out with your own life orb potentially. Oh, and it's Levitate instead of Snowcloak, word. You have Technician Focus Sash. This has Bright Powder, right? Glaceon has Bright Powder and Walrein has Chopperberry. Interesting, but still, we you do nothing to Polyrath. We got Mag Mummy. We can just flamethrower. I mean, virtually anything can kill this Obama Snow. The question is, do I want to try and set up Sunny Day somehow? Um, so we could Sunny Day with you. I don't hate that, to be honest. I feel like we're always using Chimeco, but is there anything, is there any other better sunny day setter up I guess it doesn't have to be Chimeco. It can be literally anything, but that is going to mean that we will have two Pokemon dealing with just the Bomb of Snow, but it sets up the sun as well. So let's do the rapid ass for now. And you come in and frankly, Polly just dusts you cross last with Thunderbolt. So that gives us a clean answer into, yo, hear me out. Mm, yes. Comes in though pretty, pretty well and sucker punch my kill with you. Like what's my best just straight up blizzard resist? Is it Corsola? Probably Probo Pass actually, right? I can stall it out of blizzards. And then, and then there's still Mamo. I don't think there's really anything that it quickly dies to. I think we just need a Steel type and and Chimeco, honestly, um, or a Steel type and a Flying type. Probo Pass plus. Okay, so Probo Pass absolutely coming. And then we just need a Flying type. Ugh, and Weavile has Aerial Ace. So this thing is. Do we have anything that's faster than this? Presumably Ninjask. So we come in, okay, yeah, we just come in and, okay, Ninjask is coming. And that's our flying type for the Earthquake uh, pivot as well. Jesus, can't believe how useful Ninjask has been. We're just fast. Oh, that's with Choice Band though. Uh, damn it. Probably Mawile. We at least get the Intim off. So it's plus one if we come in on a Swords Dance, does that. That doesn't crit kill. But now the issue is we do not have a flyer and we still haven't cracked how to deal with the uh with the frost lass everything else is more or less taken care of well actually no this is fine if we have a flyer who's our best flyer haunch crow probably oh also actually if we stall out blizzard with haunch crow then we can just Okay, 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 okay. So let's try that. So let's go Haunch Crow. All right, Rapid Ash is coming. This is our squad. Can Haunch Crow learn Faint Attack? No, but it can learn Aerial Ace. To do how much to, that's a four hit kill-ish on Glaceon. All right, we did it. Hell yeah. Can someone explain why he has two months sleeping? So I used Rest to put both these Pokemon to sleep. So the way that this works is that because it's a rest, it's a, uh, a sleep from rest, we're guaranteed to sleep for two turns. So I burn two turns of sleep after resting so that it, the both of these Pokemon will immediately wake up. This way, Shiftry cannot get paralyzed when it comes in on Thunderbolt. Here we go, Candice. All right. Mama Snow kicking things off hot by setting up the hail. Well, guess what, sucker? We're gonna kill you with a fire type move. Specifically, Flame Wheel.
Crit. Okay, Widow. Okay. I see you. I see you, girly. Hail continues to fall. We get hit by the hail. It kind of sucks. But now, Walrang comes out. He's going to want to use Surf. So we're going to hit Sunny Day. Oh. We got the Pasho Berry, so even if this crits, it won't kill us. It's the only way to do this. No crit, though. Good. Um. All right. Now we're going to go Nebula. I'd love if it didn't use Yawn, but it might. Yeah, it just goes Aqua Ring. That's interesting. All right. We're going to Drain Punch. It's got a Chopple Berry, so we have to take our time with this a bit. But three drain punches will kill after Choppa Berry is done. Yon is fine. Drain punch again. Ah. That's not great. Should have just close combat it. I didn't realize. 132. Okay, yes, so we got the Lumberry to wake us up, so that's fine. Um, just want to make sure. Yeah, okay. So we're still in range where Attract never kill or Shadow Ball never kills. So we're fine here. We just Drain Punch again here. Okay. Blizzard is not 50% in the sun, no. Good. Up to 57. So it should always Thunderbolt here. All right. So then we're going to the Slipping Shiftry so that Thunderbolt does not kill, or Thunderbolt does not paralyze. Okay, takes 10% life orb chip. So now Sucker Punch guarantees and we should always wake up here and kill. Okay, okay, okay. So far, so good. So far, so good. This is where it gets a little tricky. Now, ideally, Omi sees the kill here with Blizzard. Sun is gone. So we're gonna protect once. Good, all right, that's one Blizzard. Then we're going to go Proby, our only homie. It's two blizzards. You can miss these. All right. Um, I could protect here, but it should always go Earth Power. And I actually think I want to stay asleep so that we don't get frozen. It'll all, it always sees the kill with Earth Power here. So now we simply go to Haunch Crow on Earth Power. Okay. It's one Earth Power. Now we protect on a Blizzard. Three Blizzards. Now we go back to Polaris on Blizzard number four. And it misses. That's freaking huge. That's actually the perfect one to miss. Four blizzards down. Now we're going to protect to wake up. We always wake up because rest is busted. <laughs> Earth power. Now we go and finish off with Kingpin here. Okay. You have to be a little careful. We're going to protect. Let's get the last Blizzard PP. That's now all five Blizzards gone. Blizzard only has five PP, right? I'm not crazy. Okay, so now it can only Shadow Ball or Double Team me. I'm gonna Aerial Ace. Ah, um, if I kill with this, Weavile comes out before Mam, and then Weavile doesn't get its Sash broken. What I would like to do, do I have Focus Sash on you? Or what do I have on you? 
leftovers. Eh, that's lame. What I would low-key like to do is actually go shift uh, I didn't think about that. Does that make things scarier? My while you've got what? Lefties? It always sees the kill on Haunch Crow with Icicle Crash. Weavile does. So if Weavile comes out, you go Mawile. This is gonna get sketchy, folks. Should have had Focus Dash on this. Damn. Shadow Ball. Forty-two percent chance to two hit, four hit kill here. Come on, come on, come on! High roll here, Kingpin. High roll, buddy. Oh, it just doesn't heal. Interesting. That's actually I should have roosted there. If that crit could have baited Aerial Ace, although I guess that's fine. Uh, we're also we're also um, intimidating it, so this is okay as long as we don't get a load of crits and flinches. All right, Iron Man, coming on an uh, icicle crash. Not ideal, but it is what it is. Okay, that's huge. Don't swords dance. Act. I don't know. Oh, you're only at plus one. Put that focus sash. I would love if you healed here, homie. I think, unfortunately, put in two, three, four high rolls of crit icicle crash that kill us here. Unfortunately, I don't know if it's going to heal, so I have to keep Iron Man in. The alternative is if it's for sure going icicle crash or crunch. Instead of attacking, I can go Polyrath and Vacuum Wave. The problem is that if it heals on the switch, I guess I'm not throwing necessarily because then I can come back in on Mawile, it'll be at plus one, and then Brick Break more or less always kills. Um, I think it I think it heals. I don't know why, I just feel like it... They, they, they definitely heal, right? What, um, actually, though, I need, don't I need Polly for Mamo? No, 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 I got, I got Kingpin and Polaris. I honestly think it's safest to go Nebula. Nebula. Yeah, it doesn't heal. And it misses, so each Weavile. Well, <laughs> my gut was wrong. This could still get juicy, to be honest. Because Mamo does weird stuff with Avalanche. So we could very easily kill Honchcrow here, which I don't love. Though actually, there are some high rolls of Earthquake that kill with a crit. Four, again. One Earthquake. One Earthquake. I don't outspeed, no. That'd be nice though, huh? Brain Punch to get some back some HP. All right, here's hoping it doesn't do any weird shit with Avalanche. Like that, yes. me. Um, I think I just risked the crit on Polly. It is what it is. Um, the frustrating thing, we have a couple more Alakazams to deal with, and that could have been an E4mon. That was a potential E4mon. All right, Fake Out plus Leaf Blade from Shiftry kills were not faster, though. If it just goes Earthquake, Avalanche, Ice Fang, or Shadow Bat, uh, like if it goes for anything other than Avalanche, Broke 17 damage, so after fake out, it'll be down to 96, 94, excuse me. It's either Shiftry or it's risking two crits on Polyrath. Actually, Ice Shard also just kills Vulture. I gotta go Poly, but if it crits, I'm f***ed. Close combat into Vacuum Wave kills, but if it avalanches, it still only does 28%. Here we go.
Oh my god. I swear to god. Is it gonna heal now? It's final Pokemon. I mean, oh my god. It, I mean, it's just the quite like, it, it absolutely heals in the regular game, but it also in the regular game would heal, would have healed earlier. Yeah, yeah. Okay, now I remember she also didn't heal against Obama Snow or anything. All right. Then, you, Mama Swine. You dirty cheater. It's two deaths. Oh, man. Stupid Haunch Crow. I mean, that was... I know Avalanche is weird. I... I should have thought about that more.